is up. Today I'm going to be reviewing my Mixum review. So I made a zine basically and it's my first zine I've ever made and I ordered it through Mixum just to see like their printing process. It was like kind of the cheapest one that I was able to find and I just want to review it and open it up and show you guys. All right, let's do it. Okay, let's see. Hopefully I don't cut anything. looks we have just um styrofoam or bubble wrap pretty necessary and i ordered 25 copies and i ordered so i ordered 25 copies paper weight of 80 i ordered it on satin paper because it's like a photography zine and then i ordered the cover i think 110 pounds paper weight I can't even... Whoa! Alright, this looks nice actually. Wow! Oh my gosh. This is actually really nice. Alright, I'm gonna move this... No, I'm gonna move this to the floor. Oh, let me just pull them all up. Okay. So there's a stack right there. 25. Should be 25. And here's the cover. I did it in black and white just because it's a lot cheaper. <laughs> and then here's the back cover. So I think this is really cool. And it's 40 pages. So I had to do, I wanted to do perfect binding, so I had to do 40 pages of print. So let's see. Okay. So the first look, the paper is really nice. Paper is really nice. I was glad I did 80 pound paper just because I thought 70 might be a little bit thin. And the cover is kind of like stock matte. I did matte finish on the front. If you can see this. I don't know if you can see this. But yeah. So that was, this is the first thing. And let's just see. I can already tell in the beginning that like the inside, whatever this is, like the inside of the right here, it's like a little bit, looks a little bit like it's coming apart a little bit, but that's fine. And the paper is really good. It's like not, so I did satin paper and satin paper is between like gloss. So it's not like glossy and it's not like matte. It's like in between those two. So it's perfect for photos. So the cover looks really nice. It's matte finish lamination. And I have my logo on the back and I have um, info on the back as well. And then on the spine, I have, I don't even know if you can tell, White Elephant Collective. You can't see that, but I'll show you guys on the spine, text on the spine. So you have this. So I have my table of contents. I'm just looking through, the, just like reviewing the paper quality, I guess. So here's like one page example. That's one page example. It's just like a photography zine. Yeah, the text is nice. Everything came out good, I think. Yeah, this is interesting. I like this a lot, actually. I know it's not, it's not like the most high quality thing ever, but I, like it feels like good. I don't know. I think one thing that I kind of did was I kind of like put pages together. So like the center of it, you can't really see the center, but that's my own fault. So I have this, this is really nice. I like this, the paper feels good. They, so they don't have they don't have black paper even though I printed it on black. So we had to make the paper like color it black. So like print it black because it's technically white paper. The photos aren't too crisp. I don't know if that's um, more because of my photos were JPEGs I put on them, or if it's um, you know their photos. But I just wanted to include that. Yeah, I'm pretty excited about this. Yeah. Like this page, I like a lot. I don't know if, I don't know if my camera's focusing, but I'll, I'll show you guys like, I just wanted to review Mixum. I think it's really good for the money. Um, I printed 40 pages. It kind of looks like less than 40 pages. looks like, well, it's 40 pages um, front and back, so it's more like 20 pages. 
Yeah, I like the quality of this, especially for what I paid for it. I think I paid about $80, $85 maybe, um, for 25 copies. And it was 25 copies, perfect binding, 80 pound paper with satin paper, and then the cover is 110 paper with satin paper with the matte lamination finish. So that was all about $85 just for like all this. And I actually put a lot of work into these, so I'm really happy about how they turned out. Okay, feel free to comment below if you have any questions about my Mixum review. I really like Mixum, even though I've, this is the first time I've printed with them. This is my first zine ever, so I think it's pretty cool. But yeah, please like and subscribe because that helps. And I want to kind of make more videos on like design and everything. That's my review.